Doctor, watch your hands. If you aren't careful around my weapons, you'll get hurt. Here are the instruments I used to play. There aren't too many of them. But the gems on them are very valuable. Sell them, and they should cover my medical fees. Once my debt's cleared, I'd like to go back to living on my own. Would that be all right? I've seen pets kept around your hospital here. And you have a training room. I've seen some of the children you're giving intensive care in the wards. Instructor. Professor. My previous savior brought me to those with the same title. And look how I ended up. This. And this is my lyre. I may be better with other instruments, but... I like playing this one most. Listen. Such an airy, lingering timbre. And the hand moves so beautifully when playing. But when you fully lose yourself in the melody, the knife concealed inside will... I'm sorry. I got carried away. Doctor, do you intend only to treat me here? Strange. You really don't need me to do anything. I can't trust kindness with no strings attached. Let me do a little something for you, okay? I'm sure you'll be satisfied no matter the task, but... You must share with me your motivations. I remember coming back from my first fulfilled mission when I was young. Weeping and throwing up. Scared I didn't do well enough, that I would starve to death in some forgotten corner. Unknown to anyone. No longer do I fear these things. Thanks to the days with Rhodes Island, I now know how it feels to be truly alive. The originium on my arm... It hurts terribly, but... It's much more manageable by now. I know none of the physicians, but... I can't tell how sincerely they're working to save me. Doctor... Once my illness has stabilized to a point... Can I... Stay here? A lot of my past mistakes were made out of fear. I was scared. I thought that if I didn't listen to them, I was dead. But after catching Aripathy, they threw me out there to die. I should have been terrified at that moment. But instead, I was... relieved. The sun shining on my face. It was so warm. It really was. Doctor, could you take me with you on your next field mission? I want to know the reasoning behind your every decision. Why did you save me? A stranger? Just what does my life mean to you? I want to figure you out just a little clearer. All the ones before you would sleep with one eye open when I was around. Do you trust me that much? So you're the doctor from Rhodes Island? Hmm. Thank you for what you did. I'll pay for my treatment in time. Otherwise, I'd like to be on my own for now. I'm a fast learner. Don't worry. So this is how it feels. Hold my life in my own hands. This isn't the first time someone saves my life. But if I had a chance to get back to those barons, a chance to weigh up what's behind those helping hands again, I would choose to starve to death there. Doctor, I've been thinking how nice it would have been if you were there offering your hand instead. I trust your judgment. You won't lead me astray. If I make any mistakes, please point them out to me. Things are different. I don't want to hide myself any longer. It's them, right? What is it? I'm listening. 
In time, I'll find the right place for myself, too. This is the position, right? I'm aware of what I'm doing. I know what it is I want. I obey my own heart. You've gone astray. That's one more step in the right direction, isn't it? Someday in the future, I'll have as clear a direction as you do. We have a few runaways. A little like I once was. This isn't happening. Don't abandon me! Doctor! Where are you? Are you interested in my instruments? I can teach you how to play. Uh, the doctor! That's dangerous. If I leave someday, you'll send me off, won't you? Arknights. I heard the sound of your footsteps, doctor. <laughs>